If you're thinking about using Kajabi, but you're a little hesitant because maybe you've already taken the time to build an email list in a different program like MailChimp, Active Campaign, or ConvertKit, Kajabi not only hosts your website, your online courses, membership sites, sales pages, landing pages, everything. They also do email marketing and email capture, and they make it really easy to move your CSV file from MailChimp, ConvertKit, ActiveCampaign, any of those other softwares into Kajabi and they organize everything automatically for you. And that's what I'm gonna show you today. If you wanna take advantage of a free 30-day trial of Kajabi to play with the platform yourself, you can use my link profityourknowledge.com slash Kajabi. This is an affiliate link, so I get a small percentage of your investment in Kajabi, but there's no extra cost to you compared to if you went through Kajabi's website yourself. All this does is simply support me and this channel for referring someone to Kajabi. But when you sign up with my link, I'm gonna give you instant access to a course I created called Kajabi Kickstart, which is gonna help you set up and launch your online business with Kajabi in that first 30 days. On top of that, when you're inside of Kajabi Kickstart, you will have access to a free 45 minute coaching session with me where you and I both get to deep dive into your Kajabi account and I will be there to answer any questions you have about Kajabi, marketing, or even making your first sale with the platform. All of this is free and you can get instant access by going to profityourknowledge.com slash Kajabi or clicking the link down in the description. Without further ado, let's dive into Kajabi. The first thing that we're gonna want to do is to export your CSV file from whatever email provider you're using, whether it's MailChimp, ConvertKit, Active Campaign. I don't know what CSV stands for. I guess I could have looked that up. <laughs> but essentially your CSV file is a single file with all of your contacts and it has the name, the email, or phone number, address, whatever other information you might have. But as long as you have their email address, that's the most important piece. So what I'd recommend is to go to YouTube and just type in export CSV file and then whatever your email provider is that you've been using. If that's ConvertKit uh, or you can say MailChimp or ActiveCampaign, whatever you want and then just scroll down, add an import contacts. You want to export these contacts if you're gonna move your list from this provider into Kajabi. So once you've dug through, you found a good video that makes sense to you, uh, you could even go into the help center on whatever email provider you have, like MailChimp for instance, and just say, how do I export a CSV file? That's the most important thing. Once you have downloaded your CSV file, Depending on the size of your list, it could be really fast or it could take a little while if you have a really big list. But if you have a small list, couple you know, hundred people or even less, then it'll be really fast. And once you've downloaded your CSV file, then you wanna go into Kajabi. This is the main dashboard here in Kajabi. You wanna go down to the contacts tab and then click all contacts. And then from in here, you can have your list of different email contacts and then go up here to add contacts. Then you're gonna have a couple of options. You can import your CSV file. Uh, something cool is that you can also add a single contact if you wanted to, if you had a conversation with someone and they said, yeah, I'd like to be on your email list. Theoretically, you could just add them in here um, manually and you can grant them offers in here. You can select the different offers that you have, add tags to them if you said, if you had a tag of like, a new subscriber or anything like that, and you can subscribe them to marketing emails, assuming that they're okay with that. Always double check. But we want to click import CSV. When you click that, you're gonna land on this page. How do you wanna import your contacts? You can upload a file or copy and paste from a file. The fastest way is to upload the file, and that's why you should go onto YouTube to find whatever the video uh, is, or whatever, way that you can get your CSV file. That's the most important thing. Because if you go you through one of these and you download your CSV, it's gonna be a single download that you can just drag and drop into Kajabi or you can select the file from um, you know your computer, whatever it is. So you can click select file and it'll pull it up and then you can uh, pick it and then just hit continue upload. And really that's it. Again, depending on the size of your list, if you have a small list, it'll be really fast. Something cool about Kajabi is that if you have 
everything organized. If you had a Google sheet, for example, and in the top row, it was all bolded and you had like name, email address, phone number, physical address, you had different sections already laid out and all the information is organized. You can actually go into Google Sheets and get the CSV file from there if that's how you organize uh, your email list. And then you can put that into Kajabi. But what's cool is that if you have this Google Sheet already organized, Kajabi will automatically organize the information that you already have organized into Kajabi. For example, if you have name, email address, phone number, it'll already put all that information straight into Kajabi so you don't have to manually do that yourself, which is pretty cool. So they make it super easy. Again, the biggest thing is just that you have the CSV file from whatever provider you're already using. You download it, go into here, upload the file, pick whatever the file is, and then hit continue to upload and then you'll be done. So that's really all there is to it. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. Other than that, I will see you in the next one.